G'day folks, Source here for Reg TV. We're down at Runaway Bay tonight at the Future Indigenous Leaders Camp. I'm here with Russell Todd, one of our program coordinators. Russell, just tell us a little bit about what the boys and girls are up to tonight. Um, so we've had a busy day. Uh, started with a bit of archery first thing this morning at the centre here. Um, we then had to go up to Rio Tinto for our awards ceremony, our annual awards ceremony. Um, we've come back, had a bit of dinner, played a bit of basketball, and now they're, they're up to some laser tag out the back behind us. And Russell, you mentioned Rio Tinto there, obviously a major part of our Indigenous program. Yeah, massive. Um, you know, look, the program realistically wouldn't happen without without their assistance. Um, so really grateful for, the, for them to be able, for us to be able to bring all the kids down here for the week. So Russ, just tell us a little bit about how the camp fits into the Future Indigenous Leaders program and, and what the overarching point is uh, for the kids who attend. Yeah, so essentially uh, the program is, as I said, for the future leaders um, of their communities. Um, so when they're at communities, we, we pay them regular visits um, to ensure um, you know, they're on top of attendance, they're going to school, doing the right things, engaging in lessons, um, and then hopefully um, you know, paving the footprint to become leaders in their community. So the camp really, we come twice a year, one through June, July, and the second at the end of the year, and it rewards their efforts and their good behaviour throughout the year. Now, Russ, we get kids that come in from communities around the state. Tell us whereabouts all these kids are based and where they're coming from for the camp. Yeah, so they would all originally have come um, or lived in one of one of the communities we work with. So obviously from, uh, myself from Yarrabah, which is outside of Cairns. You've got Woorabinda up in central Queensland and then Sherberg as well in southeast Queensland too. And maybe we've got a couple of the Reds boys here tonight, Duncan Power and Moses Sarovi. Uh, what does it mean for the kids to get to uh, have some of our program mentors in the players come in and get involved with camp? Yeah, absolutely. Um, they're, they're fantastic with the kids, firstly. Um, really is a highlight of the trip whenever they get to come out and spend a bit of time with the uh, guys. Um, just saw at dinner time, just see the guys interacting with all the kids at dinner. Their eyes lit up. It really must, it does mean the world to them.